I'm trying to watch for a bull. I'm not seeing a bull. I see a couple spikes, but I'm waiting for a legal bull. Oh, cows. Cow, cow, cow. Are you kidding me? Not a single legal bull? shot at a ball hopefully I hope I hit him I hope I hit him I almost want to get to this other side so I can see if I did or not there's so many elk look at all of them look at all of them elk holy cow I gotta get over here and see if I hit this ball Sorry for the terrible camera work, guys. My GoPro won't turn off. Pull down, baby. Pull down. Oh. Woo! Man, that was work. That was work. Oh. Holy cow. Holy cow. Oh. Look at all the elk. Oh. I'm sorry I didn't get the shot on film, guys. He was 
right there. Is he still flopping? That was the bull I shot at before. I know he is. He was the only one in this group. He had that real tan, tan body. He's done now. No way. My truck is right there. Holy crap. Holy shit. Oh my God, he's still moving? I can't even imagine why he's taking so many shots. He's done now. He's done now. I can't figure out how to turn my camera around here. Oh, we just got a bull, guys. Oh my God. He's still moving. What is wrong with this fucking elk? This is like the fourth shot. Is he done now? It's like every time I get off the gun, the thing. There, he's picking his head up again. Like, what is going on? Oh my God. I feel so bad right now. I don't know why this thing is still moving around. Here's my range finder. Three thirty seven. Two point three. He's got to be dead now. <sighs> he wants to. Wouldn't stop fucking moving. I gotta call Alan real quick because he's still back. God, I'm just sick of shooting the thing. I'm just gonna let it bleed out. I'm not trying to wreck every single piece of meat on there. But I am trying to put this thing out of its misery. Man, he's done. He's done now. He's done. I don't know how he could take that many shots. All right. I got to call Alan. All right. I just talked to Alan. I think he's heading his way over here. Man, I can't believe how many times I had to shoot there. I hit him good. The first, like the first shot, I shot him and he just folded. And then he got back up. Did you follow their trail? The what? Did you follow the elk's trail? That's your bull? Yeah. You just got the biggest bull in the herd. Are you serious? Yes, sir. You didn't see another one laying dead in the woods anywhere, did you? No. We did it, brother. I can't believe it worked. Same day I killed last year. What? I thought it was the 22nd last year. No, 23rd. Oh. Is he still November moving? November 23, two days before my birthday. Wow. Same exact day. Dude, they were coming through these popples, and I was like 100 yards, 70 yards from them, 
sideline, like paralleling them to try and get to this field so I could find the bull again. Because uh, I shot at him twice at the, on the other park, uh, that middle park, and I think I missed. And then I was like, I need to get out here and see the herd and I need to see if that bull's in there. Because if he's not in there, then uh, I hit him and he's in the woods. But if he was out here, then I knew I needed to finish him. No, it's a monster. Is it? It looked like a big bull at first, but I didn't know. I just seen he was legal. <sighs> all right, I gotta take a break. I literally just ran all the way over here. So I'm so whooped. You see the other guy? No, I heard him shoot. I hope he got one. I heard somebody shoot over there and then I was like, fuck, it's all over. Is he done? He's not moving no more? I hope I didn't wreck a bunch of meat. He's a monster. Is he? Yep. Oh. Right. oh brother. It's just not all like grow in that huh? I ruined the back straps. He out hit him high. Son of a gun. Woohoo! There's no raghorn there. No. I honestly didn't think it was gonna happen for me this year, but same day I killed last year. I can't even believe it. Well, these last three days are hot, hot, hot. I'm mad I or four, or however you want to slice it. put your new machine inside of his spread. That's so cool. That's a cool bull. Yeah, that whale tail is amazing. I love this mass up here. This is so cool. I like how dark it is. Yeah. He just needs more ivory tips is all. He was harder to spot without ivory. Yeah. That's so cool. All right, guys, we're gonna take some pictures quick and then we'll start wrapping this thing up. All right, guys, so initially this morning, me and Alan went out hunting and we seen some deer, did some walk through some drainages and stuff like that. About 11 o'clock, we went back to the truck started making our way back toward home we were gonna go home and get some lunch and just like stopped on the road turned the binoculars behind me to check these foothills a little bit and we seen a herd of elk that were several miles away from us so we just took this road is over here as close as we can get and we got down here and the elk happened to be on the public so we burned down into this drainage and we ended up spotting the elk way out on this ridge way out here on this field and they worked all the way up into these trees down here and then started coming up this gully and we tried cutting them off over there and they spooked and bumped as you can see there's some more hunters right there they were those guys seen them too or whatever and then the elk started coming up this hill which you saw, I got that on video. And I found the bull in the group, so I knocked him over. It's crazy to think, same day that I killed last year. That's awesome. It is. And the first time the weather got cold. Yeah. In a long time. Yeah, it's been, it's been warm the last couple days, or weeks actually. We had got some snow earlier in the season, in October, and and it just kind of the weather just tend to turn for the worst thing got real warm it was in the 50s and all the snow melted and the elk really weren't moving very much today we had our first cold day and 
it just so happened the elk decided to move and it worked out for us so we're super happy we're gonna get this thing taken care of and maybe take this one out whole and in the truck because the truck is right <laughs> there i don't know how we pulled that off but we made a big circle right back to the truck not even knowing so <laughs> <laughs> that's mind-blowing i'm gonna call my wife though now and tell her about it 